I'm gonna show you guys the fastest way to grind out runes in Blade Ball. So if you haven't already, go ahead and open up the game. All right, we're gonna go straight into the server here and go over here to the left, okay? We're gonna go to the server selection, go to dungeons. It's gonna take us to the dungeon area, which is where we're gonna be farming. So your level doesn't really matter that much, okay? Uh, I was already doing this at level 10, but basically you need to fully complete this area, this grass area, okay? This is like the very beginner starter zone. You can do it with one person, two people, four people, doesn't matter. Just make sure that you complete it and that you defeat the boss, okay? And what that's gonna do for us is it's going to unlock this dungeon right here, okay? This takes us straight to the boss. We don't have to do any of that early beginning stuff, all right? That's how I got the Serpent's Wraith Blade. It was about two to three hours. I got enough to buy the Serpent's Wraith Blade, which is 10,000 of these runes, okay? Make sure that nobody is with you. We wanna do this completely solo. Keep an eye on the one out of four right here, because I don't want anybody to join us here. And if you think that doing it on hard is too difficult, I would just use play it on easy, maybe even medium if you really need to. All right, so we are in the server, and as far as the skills go, I tend to use uh, absolute confidence. I I don't think it really matters what you use. What matters is that you defeat the boss, and then just try to do it with as much health as possible. Right? You don't want to get hit if you can avoid it. So you still do the mechanics if you can. Uh, ooh, bad. There we go. One down. There we go. Two down. All right, and now we're down to two balls. So we're already at the end of the fight right now. All right. Ooh, I'm taking hits. All right, so just hit these two last two balls at him. He'll die eventually. Uh, the higher level you are, the quicker this will go. Um, I glass cannoned my way uh, to level 30. So I only had all my points and damage until it capped me at 40. So we're done. That was it. It was 44 seconds clear. We got 182 runes, guys. 168 XP, 248 coins, okay? this These rewards were decent this time. All right, so immediately hit play again. Make sure you do this quick. You only get like 10 seconds to do it. Otherwise, it takes you back to the lobby and you have to redo this whole process all over again. All right, so we're right back here where we started. Um, and we're literally just gonna do that again. Like we're doing, we're rinse and repeating the exact same thing we just did. And there we go. Done. Zone cleared. How many runes did we get that time? 200 runes, guys. Okay, and I, I did unlock some stats. You can see I ca I'm capped at 40. I'm just gonna throw it into whatever. It really just doesn't matter. You know, skip the cutscene. Go back over here to one of the corners where he's, his breath isn't gonna hit ya. Done. And just like that, boys. And see, so I had a lot less health that time. See how I had 102 runes that time? I can't 100% confirm that that's why but it seems to be the case and again you can do every every one of these runs is like 30 to 60 seconds so we're already done we got 158 runes that time 192 xp 218 coins this is a great very quick way to farm i mean we already got so many runes Alrighty, guys that is the fastest method that i know of grinding out these runes and it, honestly it's a great way to farm the mats as well right for the dungeon crafting stuff look i have 26 of these skulls just from running this okay like it's it's actually crazy so maybe uh in those other ones you're gonna have to actually do the same exact thing i did uh i haven't gotten to test it in frost area or space but i'm guessing it's, it's something along the lines of doing the exact same thing to farm different mats, okay? This is how I got the Serpent Wraith Sword, which is 10,000 runes. I got it in a, a little over two hours, okay? And everything else in the shop doesn't come anywhere near close to that cost, right? You could get this in like two, three runs. What is that, like five minutes? So this is a great way to farm out runes, to get some crafting materials, all this other stuff. I mean, you can even rule the dungeon crates if you want to. Um, if it was helpful, guys, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.